Hello, I'm Joy Pape, RN, CDE, Nursing Editor of Present Global Diabetes. And I'm here today at the American Association of Diabetes Educators annual meeting in Atlanta, Georgia. I'm here with Ann Cannon, Senior Medical Liaison for Novo Nordisk. And she is also the medical representative to AADE. Hi, Ann. Hi, Joy. How I'm are you today? Good. So glad you could make it. Thank you so much for asking me. Yes. Tell me more about Novo Nordisk and the corporate philosophy of changing diabetes. Thank you. Um, changing diabetes actually is the corporate philosophy of Novo Nordisk. And uh, changing diabetes actually is really more than, than, than just two words. The company strives for better than best classes of medications and products. We also uh, adhere to what we refer to as our triple bottom line, where we have um, social responsibility, we have the um, uh, economic, respons uh, economic viability, and also being environmentally friendly in terms of our approach to doing business. That's very good. Well, so it's, you're the, large, the world's largest maker of insulin, but you also have a reputation of being socially responsible, mm -hmm. as you said. Yes. Can you explain that a little bit more? In terms of the triple bottom line. Yes, yes it would be my pleasure because uh, really when you, when you are employed at Nova Nordisk, it's not just a job. You really do feel that there is a, a difference in the environment that you're working in. And I have to say, I've visited and I get that feel. Great, yes. great. And that, it was one of the things that, that brought me to Nova Nordisk because um, not only do we want to, uh, Nova Nordisk started with a patient, yes. which is so important. And that's where I think our alignment with AADE is so strong. We're just going to ask about that. Okay, you know, good. AADE is so, so patient-centered. Our company, Nova Nordisk, is a patient-centered company. We strive to find the best-in-class medications, the, the opportunities to really support that person with diabetes to help him or her mm -hmm. really manage their disease. Mm -hmm. And so, how are you working to accomplish these goals that you have with AADE and with bringing what you said to the patient? Mm -hmm. Along the lines um, of working with AADE, we have a very long history with AADE, which is really wonderful. Again, sharing the, the common goal of the patient, being patient-centered, I think is key. Um, along with uh, supporting, of course, obviously, conventions such as this. We have the CME that we have supported in the past and continue to support. And we have actually aligned ourselves um, as one of our uh, sponsors for our National Changing Diabetes Program, of which AADE is a very strong supporter, too. Can you tell me a little bit more about that program? would love to. Mm -hmm. uh, National Changing Diabetes Program actually um, started in about 2005. We actually formed it. It is an initiative that Nova Nordisk supports and has aligned themselves with other stakeholders, whether it be professional um, or patient-centered or patient services, to bring the needs and the concerns of diabetes management really to the political forefront. Mm -hmm. Along those lines, National Changing Diabetes has, has three key features right now that I just would like to share um, that, of, of course, AADE does support, which is, I think, important because they are one of our charter members. Um, the one is the Medicare Screening Project, which of course is for those uh, patients or individuals who are Medicare age or Medicare qualified to get screened for diabetes. Mm -hmm. You know, there's 54 million people that have prediabetes and perhaps even larger if, if right. we really look at the statistics. Exactly. 24 million people, of course, have diabetes at this point in time. We need to screen those people that may be pre-diabetic or may not know they have diabetes so that we can hopefully give them tools to, to prevent the onset of the disease. Um, in addition to, to the Medicare screening project, we have another project referred to as our diabetes goal. The national diabetes goal is by 2015 to have people who have diabetes, 45% at least, know what their A1C is, know what their blood glucose level is, and know what to do, when to take action, when to be their own advocate okay. for their care. And then finally, which is much more important, of course, I think in align with AADE's goals, is the legislative uh, support and, and um, activities that we do encourage and, and work together with, with our partners, um, specifically, of course, the legislation that's going to affect access to care for diabetes. Um, adhering to the idea of getting the CDE recognized as a Medicare provider, which of course is near and dear to the AAD uh, members here right. now. Right. So those are just three, um, I guess, key initiatives that we're working on right now, along with other partners. So. Gonna, and three of the many, because I know of others. Yes, so. there are many, many. Along the legislative side, there are many. Uh, we, we strive to, to seek out those um, legislative issues that are tr is truly going to support the person with diabetes and help better manage the disease. Well, and thank you so much, and of 
course, thank you, Novo Nordisk. Oh, my goodness, thank you. And, of course, we look forward to a wonderful uh, convention here over the next few days. And uh, we look forward to continued alliance with AAD as we change diabetes. Great. Thank and you. from Present Global Diabetes, we thank you.